Hi everyone, I'm really excited to discuss this topic with you all today because I find health and our body so fascinating, but more so when we can merge science and spirituality together. And this specific blog today is uh, no exception. And I'm going to talk to you today about how you can physically reverse the aging process within your body according to science as well as spirituality. Now, recently on my podcast, I had a guest come on and it was in last week's episode. His name is Agi Nas, and he talked to us about the, how to reverse the aging process through certain supplementation and other um, effects and how it works. Now, in 2009, there were three scientists who won the Nobel Prize for discovering the uh, effects of telomeres in our chromosomes and how it's related to the aging process. And that if we are able to lengthen our telomeres, we can literally reverse our aging process and revert to a more youthful version of ourselves. Why has this not been released to a greater extent that all of us have heard about? I mean, it's almost 10 years later now. And as someone who consider, I consider myself pretty well versed within the health field. I've been studying the natural effects of healing and on, on our physical bodies. And I didn't hear about this until recently. And so I want to do this video to bring it to your attention. And if you can share it with everyone, you know, because Let's face it, the anti-aging business is a multi-billion dollar industry and people are, are spending exorbitant amounts of money on external creams and things and surgeries and, and injections to promote a more youthful appearance. But in this video today, I'm going to show you how for probably pennies on the dollar, you can reverse the aging process through specific supplements for your body, as well as a couple of activities that will that are free to do uh, that you can do as well. So let's just talk about first about telomeres. What are they? So in our DNA, we have our chromosomes and each chromosome on the end of each chromosome, there are what's called telomeres. Think of them like a protective cap. Uh, if you think about your shoelaces, it's like, you know how you have that plastic cap at the end of the shoelace, prevent it from fraying and allow it to go through the hole of your shoes more easily. This is what a telomere does. It protects the chromosomes from fraying. And also if the telomeres were not to be there, then chromosomes would start attaching with other chromosomes and start altering our gene expression. So telomeres are very, very important. Now what happens is with age, our telomeres begin to shorten because every time your cell replicates, it shortens a little bit more. But instead of the actual chromosome shortening, it's the telomere that shortens. Now, this is a natural process of aging. So when we're born as infants, we have a very long telomere. And as we grow older, these telomeres start to, to shorten and shorten and shorten. Now, there are certain things that are linked to um, speeding up, accelerating the shortening of our telomeres, and that is obesity, um, inflammation, and oxidative stress. Uh, so shortened telomeres are highly correlated with cardiovascular disease, um, neurogenerative, neurogenic, neurodegenerative diseases, and uh, I'm going to actually go into a little bit more of that a little bit later on in uh, this. So understanding that our telomeres do shorten, what happens is when the telomere gets to a specific length of shortness, that it reaches the chromosome reaches what's called a critical length and it stops replicating and dies. And so this accumulation of dead cells within our body is what leads to the aging um, expression. So wrinkles, uh, looser skin, like all of these things that a lot of us are trying to, um, to maintain and maintain our youth. Uh, these things are, this is what the telomeres um, are responsible for. So the next question is, well, can we lengthen our telomeres? Can we not only prevent the shortening of our telomeres, but can we start to turn back the, the, hands of time and actually lengthen the telomeres? And the answer is yes. 
uh, yes, you can actually lengthen your telomeres. So how do we do it? So there are certain supplements that have been correlated with telomerase expression. Now telomerase is an enzyme that helps to improve the lengthening of telomeres. When telomerase is not expressed, that's when our telomeres begin to shorten. So having um, this telomerase enzyme in our body is very important to not only maintaining the length of our telomeres, but also increasing the length of our telomeres. Now, I wanna make a quick note here about something very interesting. Cancer cells are known to have a high expression of telomerase activity. And that is why cancer cells tend to metastasize and grow at rapid rates, is because of these, the high expression of telomerase. So what they found is that if they can inhibit the telomerase activity within cancer cells, they can not only slow it down, but reverse cancer from uh, occurring in our bodies. Now, at first, when you hear that, it might sound a little bit kind of gloomy because that means if you're, to me, when I first thought that, it's like, well, if you're inhibiting the telomerase in cancer cells, that means you're inhibiting the telomerase within your healthy cells. And the answer is actually no. These supplements that I'm gonna to talk to you about actually inhibit telomerase activity in cancer cells while assisting and expressing telomerase in our healthy cells. Very, very interesting. So um, I'm gonna get into what supplements you can start taking right now that are going to assist you in reversing the aging process. And the first one is astragalus root. Now, interestingly enough, when I was 20, I started seeing a naturopathic doctor and she prescribed me to start taking astragalus root um, to help combat stress in my life. I was in school, I was a student, and I was taking on a lot of work to help pay off my bills, my student bills, and so I was under a lot of stress, as most students are. And of course, as you know, when you get out into the quote-unquote real world, the stress keeps piling up as you begin to have a family and you have bigger bills, mortgages, all of this can amount to much more stress in our lives, especially if we're not doing anything to counterbalance the stress. So astragalus root makes a lot of sense. Now, in particularly why you wanna start taking astragalus root is because of two compounds that are found in it. Now, these two molecules found in astragalus root are called cycloastragonols and astragalocides. These two molecules are very effective at lengthening the telomeres of our, of our chromosomes because they activate the telomerase expression in our body. Now, interesting to note, of course, scientists have found a way to create a medical grade of this enzyme, and it's called TA65. Now, it's interesting to note that studies have been done that show astragalus root is actually more effective than taking this enzyme TA65. So, not only that, but TA65 is going to set you back about $400 a month. And not a lot of people are willing to spend that kind of money, especially when the results are less promising than taking the natural component astragalus root. Astragalus root also will probably only set you back $15 a month. So much more affordable and uh, it's a natural uh, product. So, you know, I always believe that nature has provided, provided us with everything that our body needs. And so I'm always going to um, err more onto the natural side than before I take anything medically grade. Now, astragalus root is very important and I take um, the powder form and I'm just gonna show you. So I have this bag here. Now, this is a one pound bag and it costs me under $15 and it'll last me over a month. So that to me is a great deal. Now, astragalus root is the number one supplement that you want to take when you want to lengthen your telomeres. However, there are other supplements that I'm gonna give you right now that are going to assist in that process as well. They are also responsible in supporting telomerase expression in your body. However, they're, they're not as strong as astragalus root. But the way I look at it is the more assistance I can give my body right now, the, the better off uh, the results will be and probably the faster they're going to appear. So the next one I'm going to talk about is vitamin B. Um, B6, B12, and folate, folic acid are very, um, I've shown in studies, very important in 
helping your telomerase um, activity. Uh, vitamin D is also been shown to be very supportive to uh, the telomeres being long. So getting enough sun, sunlight, making sure you're getting sunlight is very important to assisting in your telomerase expression. Now, another um, supplement that I've been taking is reishi mushrooms. Now, reishi mushrooms, interestingly enough, are one of the very few foods that assist in producing vitamin D within your body. So if you're in a climate where you don't get a lot of sun or you're just leading a certain lifestyle where you can't get outside that much um, during the daylight hours, reishi mushroom is actually a, a really great supplement to be taking to assist in vitamin D production. The other cool thing about reishi mushrooms is that it's been shown to deactivate the telomerase uh, activity in cancer cells. So this is um, one of those supplements where you can actually reduce the telomerase activity in your cancer cells while promoting the expression within your healthy cells. Very, very cool. Okay, so this next one I'm gonna talk to you about is actually really cool. Um, and I've personally found so many benefits with taking it. But turmeric, turmeric is very um, effective at, at uh, the, having a high correlation with lengthening um, telomeres. Now, the reason is, is that because inflammatory markers have been found to be related to the telomere shortening, um, so lower telomerase activity. This makes a lot of sense. Turmeric is very potent at being an anti-inflammatory. Um, now, I take a tincture form. I do have it here. Um, I take an organic tincture form, and I find the tincture much more powerful than the capsules or the powder form. Uh, so, and, and I've heard people who've taken capsules and they're not getting the same benefits. So I would suggest if you're interested in turmeric, uh, try and use the tincture format. But what's interesting is to note is that there was a study done on turmeric and telomere lengthening and Alzheimer's. So what they found is that when turmeric was taken, it increased the protective, uh, protective barriers of the brain limiting Alzheimer's expression. However, when telomerase was um, inhibited, the positive effects of turmeric on the brain disappeared. So this told um, the scientists who were producing this study that there was a high correlation between telomerase activity and turmeric um, assisting that activity. Okay. So these are some of the supplements that you can take um, to assist in uh, lengthening your telomeres. Uh, now, I'm gonna get into two activities that you can do for free that also promote the lengthening of telomeres. And the first one is exercise. Uh, exercise uh, reduces stress in the body and it's been shown to really reduce the signs of aging. There is a correlation um, through studies that physical exercise is related to having longer telomeres. Personally, as someone who uh, has been personally training people for almost 10 years now, I see a huge um, correlation between the aging process of those who don't exercise versus those who do. Okay, this is where it gets very interesting. The next exercise that I'm gonna to offer to you to do is meditation. It has been shown that meditation has a strong correlation with the lengthening of telomeres. Now, this doesn't surprise me um, as someone who's been meditating for over 20 years. Uh, when we just look at the, the way of how meditation helps to combat stress in our bodies and how we, um, how we react to certain stress factors, it's pretty obvious that this would be um, related. However, it's specifically related to the lengthening of telomeres, not just reducing the aging process. So um, what they did is they did a study on cognitive behaviors and how having a balanced cognitive um, expression was highly correlated to having longer telomeres which means they found that people who um, were 
uh, triggered by someone who is angry and perceived them as a threat, perceived them um, through um, fear, that there was a strong correlation to those people having shortened telomeres. However, people who were meditating and had much more cognitive balance would perceive the same threat as not threatening. In fact, they would see this person in a completely different way, which makes complete sense because if there's anything I realized through my spiritual practice is that we create our reality through our perception. And when we can alter our perception, we can alter the world around us. So very interesting. So I am going to recommend that if you can find a way, even if it's five or 10 minutes a day, to take some time to meditate, to be very present so that you are in con total control of how you not react to um, outside stressors, but act towards outside stressors will help influence your telomere activity. So very, very cool stuff. Um, like I'm really shocked. Okay, no, I'm not shocked actually. Uh, I'm disappointed that this information isn't more heavily available to us. I mean, if you go online and you start Googling this stuff, you're gonna find a ton of information, but however, why isn't this much more mainstream? Why aren't we able to know this? And I'm actually gonna get, I get into those um, details in my podcast episode that just came out last week. So if you guys are interested in hearing the full interview with our guest, Augie Nost, and how this whole telomere activity works and more supplements that you can take to improve your um, age reversal, then I'm going to leave a link below to that specific um, episode of our podcast because it's very interesting. And I just love, love, love when we are equipped with knowledge and information to empower ourselves through our physical bodies, through our mental bodies, through our emotional bodies, and our spiritual bodies. So really cool episode. Um, check it out if you're really interested in reversing your own aging process. Um, what else? Oh, yeah. If you're interested in um, getting some of these supplements, I'm going to leave a link um, also in the description below that'll allow you to get some of these products at 10% off. So you get 10% savings if you um, want to look into some of these products. Um, and of course, if you're interested in any more about me, please head on over to my blog, inflexibleme.com. I have a newsletter there that you can sign up for so that you're updated on every blog that comes out as well as events. I do have a webinar coming out this month. So if you're interested in that, you can get more information by signing up to my newsletter. And of course, um, my podcast, we are in interviewing some really awesome guests who are bringing forth this really cool knowledge for all of us to empower ourselves. So if you're interested in hearing more about that and lots of topics about the spiritual journey, please check out my podcast and lighten up. It's available on iTunes, comes out every Thursday. All right, everyone. Uh, I hope that you found this blog uh, interesting, informative, and most importantly, empowering to you and your own health. I think it's important that we all want to live longer on this planet, but also to increase our vitality and our actual quality of life so that, you know, we're not crippled. Who wants to live a long life if we're not able to enjoy it fully to our fullest potential? So I hope that this information helps you in um, experiencing a much higher quality of lifestyle as well as, hey, looking a little better, right? We all, we all wanna have a more youthful um, uh, appearance and I don't think there's anything wrong with that, especially if that's what our body is intended to be. So um, all for that. All right, everyone, have a great week and I will be, next, I will be back next time with more knowledge.